Welcome to Dr. Lee Unplugged, real insights from the cutting edge. This is a stripped down video where I share behind the scenes insights as a scientist and as a doctor mm -hmm. on different health and wellness topics. It's raw, direct, unscripted, no sugar coating, just real talk and real science. And today we're gonna to talk about your lungs and foods for lung health. Now, food as medicine is making headlines everywhere and it's important to know that whatever we're actually putting into our body can affect our lungs uh, and the rest of our respiratory tract, which actually starts from our nose and our mouth, goes all the way down to our sinuses, and then goes down uh, the tubes, the, the bronchial, and all the way down to, uh, to our lungs. And when we're talking about the health of our lungs, we're not just talking about the absence of disease. Our lungs have to protect themselves to stay healthy um, using these hardwired health defense systems. These same health defense systems protect our health in every part of our body, but in the lung, let me just tell you what they are and what do they do. All right, so the first health defense is called angiogenesis. It's my area that I study, angio, blood, blood vessel. Genesis, how our body grows and protects blood vessels. Now, this is a 60,000 mile channel throughout all of our bodies. But from our lungs perspective, we need a good blood flow because it's our blood that carries the oxygen that we breathe to the rest of our body. And it's our blood in our lungs that actually expel carbon dioxide so that we can breathe in and breathe out. We're going to talk about that a little bit more in a second. Number two, second health defense in the lung is our regenerative system. We have stem cells in our lungs as well as elsewhere in our body, but in our lungs, our stem cells can help to repair our lungs. Why do we need them repaired? Well, because you're breathing in crap all the time, right? Think about that. You're painting your room. You're breathing those fumes. You're um, painting your fingernails or removing fingernail polish, that acetone you're breathing in. That's all damaging to the cells of your lungs, and your lungs have to fix that. And the good news is that regeneration as a health defense can help to repair your lungs from exposures. The third thing is the gut microbiome. Now it turns out our gut microbiome, which is actually not in our lungs, it's actually in our gut, also affects inflammation throughout our body. A good healthy gut microbiome, low 